What's up, y'all? I'm about to open up my PS5. <laughs> Man, it been taking a, it took a long time for it to come. I ordered it from StockX on December 29th, so like two weeks ago. Finally came today. So let's see. I ain't opened it yet, so they might got me a box of rocks in here, but let's see. So we got the, you know, certified, certified sign on there. Yeah. Let's see what's in here, man. StockX is legit. That's the PS5 big as hell, man. That's ridiculous. What's up, y'all? Just gonna talk to you guys about um, my PS5. Uh, I bought a PS5 off StockX because I got tired of uh, waiting for PS5 drops. I got tired of actually getting on the site at the right time and wasn't able to add the card. All right, again, took out the card. All right, they're saying. Oh, this item is already out of stock every time. I think I tried maybe about 10 times since the PS5 dropped. I had a, I was part of a Discord where they let you know every time PS5 dropped. And um, I was following Jake Randall Page, G Bird. Uh, what's the other nigga name? I don't know. I, I was following all of them. Still couldn't get one. Uh, this dude named Cheeto Gang Gaming. I was following every single PS5. Dude, still can't get one, even though I was there right on time for every Target drop, every Best Buy drop, every PS PS Direct. Every time I got a PS Direct, it was an hour wait. So, after a month or two of trying, December 29th was my last draw. I think it was Target drop. I was there early. Uh, I was going to every single store trying to add my PS5 to cart. Kept getting took out every single time. It got on my nerves so bad. Like, you know what? I'm at to give in to the give in to the resellers, man. So I went to StockX. I did research before I used it. And uh, it was pretty expensive. I'm part of Broke Gang. And I paid a penny. It was for a peace of mind thing because I was spending too much time waiting on drops. It was annoying waiting on drops for 7 o'clock, 3 o'clock. Waking up early trying to get a drop. It was annoying as shit, you know. Even though I got an Xbox, I got a, a Series S. It's pretty dope, but I'm a PS5. Do I got a lot of games on my PlayStation library or whatever. So I want a PlayStation. Xbox is pretty cool, but I need my PS5, man. And um, so I, I went to StockX, paid a lot of money for a digital edition. Probably twice a retail price. But it was worth it to me. I ain't got to look at Jake Reynolds page. Uh, see him talk about securing the bag. Uh, he really cool dude, but I got tired of looking at them. You know, he talking about don't give up. And if you don't got the money, you can wait for the drops. But it's annoying. It was just taking too much time out of my day trying to get a PS5. So, um, yeah, I got my PS5. Um... It took like two weeks and the seller shipped it right away. I was happy. Then it took forever to get there to the site. So they took them about a week to get it. And then it took a couple of days for them to verify it. Then they sent it to me and I got it yesterday on the 12th. And then like when I got on PS5, it's like, damn, I ain't got to hunt no more. And it's like, damn. 
kind of missed that hunt, but I'm happy to get PS5. Um, if you got extra money and you just tired of trying to spam at the cart, watching Jake Randall, just go to StockX or anywhere else you can find it for a good deal. I don't really like Facebook Marketplace because I don't want to meet up with nobody. But yeah, man, that's how I got PS5, StockX, just like a lot of people got it. I think the price is going to go down. I, mean, I think it was like 1000 at one point on StockX, but now it's like 700 or lower for an edition. But for a PlayStation, the PS5 digital edition. But yeah, only guys who about come below, man, tell you feel.